Hello gamers and welcome back, I'm Rob of course, or Warshack if you want to call me by my in-game name and we're going to be playing some of that sweet meme priest before we go in, uh, hang out at the Red Hot Chili Peppers concert. Uh, we're going to try to knock out a good old deck testing before we go out and have a good time tonight. Uh, also, we're streaming on Twitch of course, uh, which is why you see the layover and um... Yeah, Mean Priest should be fun. We played a couple games with this before, and we it actually sh uh, showed some decent results. Um, so I'm going to keep it going and see if we can modify the deck a little bit. I know this variant isn't like, you know, it doesn't run Lyra, and it doesn't run as many uh, uh, Shadow Ward deaths and pain as I want, but I didn't know how to make room, so I figured this was a good list to kind of start with. Um, Razor Leaf should be fine. Silence is pretty good with the Razor Leaf. I'd almost rather look for Purify, to be completely honest. And the Shadow Visions, I'm pretty sure we just always keep that. Um, because it could find, you know, Purify, Divine Spirit, Inner Fire, and all that stuff. So I don't really mind keeping these two in the opening hand. Hey, Rube, thanks for the early stream. You will have a blast tonight. I was on a Red High Pivot Comp set in Germany recently, and it was amazing. Nice, Royal. I'm really excited to go. It's going to be like one of my first normal concerts, because all my concerts I go to are like, you know, EDM people. So there's not really any uh, singing going on, uh, but now that there's actually singing going on, I'm sure it'll be a little bit different. Like there's like chairs where you like sit down and listen to it instead of like stand up. So uh, it'll be interesting. And I also don't know the attire to wear. I figure it's going to be hot as shit in there. So that's why I'm wearing a tank top, only because it's super, I don't want to wear a long, like a button up long sleeve and be sweating my... My ass off. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Hearthstone did decide that I really need the silence. So he just played the secret. He's playing what looks to be Kazakus Mage, which is kind of scary. Um, do we just go Humongous Razor Leaf to, to see if that's a... Uh... Alright, I think we're good to go. So we go Faceless Shambler onto the Razor Leaf. Ah, oh, this is this has got to be ignoring er, annoying for this mage. I wonder what these secrets are though. I also don't want to shambler this guy, and then have um. You know what? Let's first things first. Let's silence him. That's fine. It's totally okay. I just didn't want to Shadow Visions, and I didn't want to play a creature and him copy it, especially if it's the Shambler. So now I can Shambler this guy, and we're good to go. It's basically GG's. It's basically the GG's on the Boop. And now what do we make? Do we trade there, or do we trade there? I mean, I'm at 23 health, so trading here doesn't seem to be the worst thing in the world. But also trading here because we don't have one damage to do to anything. Forces him to ping though. This is fine. I'd rather attack that when he heals for nothing. What's up, TC? How's it going? Someone is using my super secret mage. I would have to say, if you're going to play a secret mage, you don't need the crystal runner. This is just a bad decision to put. Like, you don't need that card in the deck at all. Not at all. So I guess we go Shadow Visions first. Purify, Divine Spirit, or Inner Fire? I suppose Inner Fire. I really want to go Purify too, but we're going to go Divine Spirit. Oh, fuck. I meant to pick Inner Fire. Gosh darn it. That's fine. What if this is Vaporize? Oh, whoo. I got so scared. <laughs> Actually, yeah, we should have played around Meteor by moving this on the left-hand side. Meteors, uh, ouchie boo boos. Meteor, ouchie boo boos. Is someone injured? I think this is the play. I really didn't like it that much. Maybe we should have gone for like a silence. This would have been at five, and then we could have silenced one of these, made the trade, and then we wouldn't be weak to these trades.
That hurts me. That hurts my bad. So I guess we would just buff this guy, right? And then we would heal the other dude. I'm an idiot. Why would I do that? Why would I not silence the card first? Rip me. Alright, it was all part of the plan. Now let me think of the new plan. <laughs> now I gotta think of the new plan because I'm a, I'm a goose. For some reason, this didn't look like a silence to me. Like, this, I didn't, this, in my head, I was like, it's not a purify and it's not a silence, so I can't use it. We should have just gone ahead, silenced this, and then we could have given it whatever and then swung face. And now we're basically stuck on the plan of what do we do? Do we divine spirit this and let this die to a ping, or do we heal this, divine spirit that, and put it at 14? That is the question. I really don't want him to kill this. Fourteen is still a lot. Drunk already, Rob? No, I just haven't played this deck that much, to be honest. Not that it's an exceedingly hard deck to play, but still, silencing your own minions is not something you'd normally do. <clears throat> That's not a bad one. To uh, Shadow Ward. So if we silence our own guy, he goes to a 4-8. I kind of want to just silence the Watcher and have the Watcher trade. Doesn't feel that fantastic, but it's better than... Uh, better than uh, having this go down to a 4-8. I'd rather just make this guy a taunt, to be honest. Well, that's not good. That is good. Get him. <laughs> Alright, so we've built the wall. Uh, 515 is pretty difficult to get past, so he's going to have to like polymorph it, or he can uh, glyph into maybe another meteor. That would be really bad. I'm you. I'm glyph into Kabbalist Tome. It's good that he actually picked these low drops, because him creating not value minions from that is like really good for us. Okay. Frost bolting the five five. Okay. He's got a lot of shit going on. Yeah, he does. I cannot do that. My shield for Argon. I think we're gonna kill the Alex Straza. And then we're gonna heal the six three. If I'm correct. Yes. The reason we need to kill the Alex Straza is because we don't want our 515 taking all that damage. He's gotten so much value, though, and we're out of cards. Hmm. I'm not sure we win this one because of that really bad not being, not silencing this. But imagine if this could be attacking. If this was attacking right now, we could maybe win because if we drew an inner fire, we'd be able to do a lot of damage. But if we silence this, it, it's this will never be able to attack the way we've set it up. It's just a wall. It's a wall of goodness. I guess if we draw another Northshire Cleric, maybe we can get like Northshire Cleric into Power Ward Shield into like another Taunt into something. <laughs> All right, Shield. Northshire Cleric. Yes, the plan. The plan. It's being put together. Yes, yes, yes. Grow, my minion. Grow. Yes. No, I'm just kidding. Purify is probably not going to do shit. We don't even attack this. Or do we? Probably not. Because then, if all right. So if we attack this, he can play the six drop. He just goes down to one, so he can ping it. So we guess we just go face. What's going on? Who's leaving? Alex leaving? See you later, Alex. Have a good nap. As long as we can keep the cleric alive, we're good to go. Oh, no. He's going to frostbolt this? No. It's going to die. Don't kill my cleric. She deserves so much more. Stop it. <laughs> no. 
All right, I guess now we have to silence this. We've come to the time where this needs to get silenced. If we purify it again, it doesn't really do too much. If we purify it again, then we have nothing. Yeah, we would have stuff for the Humongous Razor Leaf. So I guess we uh, silence it again. Oh, do we make it a 7-7 seven, seven or we just trade? I don't think it really matters. Unless it's vaporized. Yeah, now we lose. It is finished. We could have played that better. We got him next time. Because purifying it, we just needed to draw. That was the problem. We kind of ran out of juice when we didn't silence that one guy because we invested too much and he was never able to attack. So we could never do the inner fire combo. So we fucked up. Taranda versus Taranda. It was my mistake. The is my Pain's good. I mean, we have the combo pieces all right here. Do I just keep this hand? We know Priest is pretty slow, unless he's running like dragons. Maybe I keep everything. I don't know. Let's see if we keep anything. What's up, Ham? Thank you for the follow and welcome to the shack, buddy. Meme versus meme. <laughs> it's basically whoever OTKs the other person first, right? Look at this four attack creature against a priest. What is he going to do? What is he going to do? Thanks, Boosh. We don't have the sub button yet. The Twitch said it's coming soon, though. They, like, with their affiliates, they said that because they just started, like, literally, they just started sending invites between yesterday and today, that it's going to take them a little bit. But, I guess we just pain this, right? What do I think of Lyra? She's really good. Lyra's a lot better than what people originally expected her to be. I don't think we do anything yet. We have to silence this card first. Before anything, this card must get silenced. Which means we have to go Song Stealer before we do any sort of buffs. Hit him with that silence. Make that easy trade. Next turn we can go like Cleric. Heal it. Just keep it. Uh, like this guy, we're just going to keep him at 4 attack until we're going to win. See you later, Bleach. Glad to have you here, buddy. <sighs> You're getting a sub button? Yeah, we're a YouTube affiliate now, TC. You didn't see the the post on Twitter and or Instagramo? And that you can now donate through bits, I think they're called. I don't understand why you would do bits instead of just doing normal PayPal stuff, but whatever. There must be a reason. Is someone injured? Hmm. I don't think we play the other cleric. And playing the Sun Fury doesn't really do anything, to be honest. If we double it and enter fire, it's still not enough. So we'll just kill him next turn. So we have lethal next turn. Bits look cooler? I would have to say that is true. That's unfortunate. I'm glad I didn't invest the other cleric. Is someone injured? You wish to live forever. Do we go ahead and we Talon Priest this? I feel like it's really, really weak to... um. It's really weak to Shadow Word Pain now. If this gets Pain, then it was a mistake to do that. We should have done it on like a... Sun Fury Protector or something, I don't know. Maybe we should have done nothing. Let me change your mind. <laughs> okay. Lols. Like everybody plays this card in their deck. Lel. L l l l I see gold. Pretty sure I can get away with nah. We should probably attack this. I can't believe we just got punished by a, by a shadow priest. 
I haven't seen this card played in so long. Maybe he's playing Meme Priest, but what would this be doing in the deck? I don't know, maybe he's just playing Control Priest? That is the question. <laughs> Get the beer out of your stream? Oh, we can't do that. I've got, um... I've got to drive. So we just need another Divine Spirit, and we're off by one? No, we could get it with Defender, right? Because this would be four, five, nine, and we're at nine. So we just need the other Divine Spirit, and we win. We go Divine Sp No, 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 we go Argus. No, we could actually maybe even do it, because that'd be six, 12. Silence does not do it. Yeah, this is unfortunate. Like, we're drawing all of the pieces that aren't needed, if that makes sense. Like, we, I guess we'd never hold these. Because they've been sitting in our hand. And then these. And then we can't draw the Watcher, the Razor Leaf, the Shamblers. We haven't been able to draw any of those. So do I kill this or do I kill this? That is the question. And I can't go, like, Divine Spear, Inner Fire. Because then it just dies to a Shadow Word Pain. This has to be OTK. We could go, like, Sun Fury Protector, Defender of Argus, and then trade, I suppose. And then the question is, what do we trade into? I kind of want to kill Lyra. I can, I can actually just go ahead and silence Lyra, and then kill that, and then heal it, but then he draws. So I guess we would just silence this, attack this. And then heal it back up. That was actually pretty nice. It wasn't the best play, but, you know. That's the, that's the only thing we could really do. If we keep the Lyra alive, we lose. If we keep the Norshire Cleric alive and we heal our dude, he draws cards. Could he have overdrawed? Yeah, he actually would have overdrawn. So maybe killing the Cleric wasn't bad, because then we should have just attacked the Lyra. No, we would have attacked the Cleric. No, yeah, we would have, we would have hit the Cleric. Yeah, we should have kept the North Shire Cleric alive. The Cleric, or the, the Shadow Priest. Yeah. So we should have killed this, healed it, and he would have overdrew one. I wasn't paying attention. He had 10 cards, in, or 9 cards in his hand. Say Mind Vision. Oh, and he got my Shadow Word Death. Oh, if we, if we draw a Divine Spirit here, that feels so bad. Alright, Pewterfy doesn't mean anything. Rip. It is finished. Good news is, if this deck, if we just play against any aggressive base deck, we do just fine. Unfortunately, we've gone against two control decks. Alright, so if we draw Divine Spirit or Inner Fire, we don't keep those. I'm pretty sure we keep Purify. And then we keep Razor Leaf and or Watcher for sure. We're doing alright, Mental. Thanks for asking. Oh my gosh. Shaman. So I think we keep everything here. Besides the inner fire. Because we play the Watcher, we buff the Watcher, and then we Shambler. Like, all of this seems okay. Again, I really haven't played this deck a lot at all, so I'm not really sure what we're looking for. Because the whole deck revolves around basically three minions. And that's our Watcher. Well, actually four minions if you count the Cleric. But most of the time, you don't buff the Cleric um, as much as you would buff like the Watcher um, or the Razor Leaf or the Shambler. Right? Because those have more HP. It's always about the buffing the HPs. They go to like 10, you know, ish. And then you like Inner Fire or you have like two Divine uh, Spirits and then you just go from there. Turn one Ancient Watcher? Nah, nah, nah. We save coin. We need to coin out the Shambler. Or we could, yeah, we can still coin out the Shambler. I don't think it's really needed to, though. I'd rather just give this a whole bunch of HP, but first we have to silence it. So, do we Shadow Visions, or do we just, yeah, I think we go Shadow Visions, because whatever buffs we put on here, it's going to be a waste. We have to silence it first, unless we want to wait next turn and go Song Stealer, but then I can't guarantee that that's actually going to live. But then we have, like, all these other silences in our deck. We get three mana, and then we'd have to coin it out. So we need the zero mana silence, and then we would go with the Power Word Shield. 
I don't think we do it yet. I think we just hold tight. I think we hold tight. I mean, we could coin the faceless, but I don't like, like that play that much. But it's not the worst play in the world. Maybe I'm being too greedy, but then we can't coin this, but then we would be able to shadow visions and then silence and then shield it. I could be overthinking this. When has the meme gone too far? Maybe this. The best play is to mine visions a car from the enemy, then you can double divine spirit inner fire and get a sweet 32-32 minion. <laughs> or you can just play mind control tech and take their 2018. So just never play priest, just tech in a mind control deck. 25% chance to own your opponent. What's up, Ganda? Hmm. We still don't know what kind of shaman he's playing. I'm actually not that sad that he did that. Because now that he devolved, he's, he doesn't have a devolve later. When, like, we've got bigger and better creatures. Like, it's bad, but it's not super bad, if you know what I mean. Sunwalker's good. We can actually just start buffing this uh, defender up. This defender can actually, this could be our winning ticket. So it looks like he could be playing jades, unless he just has the jade package in here. Woohoo! Ooh. So we could go Northshire Cleric, heal. Or we could go Talon Priest, heal. Or we could just forget about this card. And just, you know. Invest into something else like Northshire Cleric, Talon Priest. Or are we would Talon Priest the Northshire Cleric. Because we know this is probably going to die anyway. Because it only goes to five. If we give Cleric, we can make it go to... Yeah, I guess Cleric's not a bad deal. You wish to live forever. This seems okay. I mean, he only has four on board, so he needs a Jade Lightning. Yeah. That's the only card in his deck that stops it. I guess Flame Tongue Totem, too, but a lot of these players aren't running Flame Tongue Totem, and if they do, it's only run one of them. Because there's just so many better cards that you can put in your deck. What's up, Joint? Hmm. If he had Jade, if he had the Jade Lightning, he would have probably played it by now. So, which makes me think his turn six could be Panda Bitch. But he's scared of dying. But we don't have Inner Fire or Divine Spirit, so he could play like it's his only option to play Panda Bitch, really. You've got one option, shaman. Yeah, it's pretty weak. It's exceedingly weak to Dragonfire Potion, which is not in our deck, but he doesn't know that. That was a really bad draw. Uh, maybe, maybe it's time that we forget about the uh, <laughs> about the defender and we go with like the Sunwalker. Or we would go with Shadow Visions, Shadow Visions, all in with this, but I don't really like that. I'll just go with the Walker. This trades here, this goes face. I just have to wait till I have the combo, kind of. We didn't have a good start because he devolved our board. Where's the mini fridge, Rob? It's in the back. It's actually still plugged in, it just hasn't turned on yet. Hey, Rob, any chance we get an earlier stream? Yeah, we'll probably do an earlier stream later. Um in the week it's just unfortunately during the day um i'm working on other youtube videos and then i wanted to stream a little bit before the concert tonight so it looks like he has like a light lightning storm Ooh, the echo okay 
Oh, so he's just playing the deck that was on stream today. How unoriginal. There was some Jade Shaman on stream today. That makes me so sad. At this point, it just makes more sense to go with the Talon Priest. But it's fine. We just need to get a razor leaf and get the shambler down and we're good to go. And then draw an inner fire. But we still have a shadow visions. So we can get an either an, another inner fire with this or a purify if we need it. We're good to go. What's up, Tony? Lightning storm. Rip board. Why wouldn't you want to kill off this first? Where are the aggro decks at? I want to go against an aggro deck so I can, like, just put up a taunt wall. I'm going against, like, these slow, grindy decks. Which are not decks that we really want to go against, to be honest. So if you go Watcher, Shambler, that's six. But Watcher, Divine Shield, Slambler is two. Then we need to Sun Fury... Um, we also could go with, like, Watcher, Silence, Spirit. What if he hexes it? Well, if it gets hexed anyway, I'm so fucked. It's between this and silencing it. Hopefully he doesn't kill it. And then we would go Divine Shield. Or we just Divine... It's probably... This is just the safest play. And it's gonna get fucking hexed regardless. If he has hexed, we're gonna get wrecked if he doesn't have hexed. Then we have one more turn to go. But this getting silenced now, that's not the plan. We can't do it. This is the plan right here, the Shambler. Doesn't have Hex? Question mark? Oh, okay. We still have two Humongous Leaves in our deck, though. And two Divine Spirits. Because the Divine Spirit we got came from the Visions. Oh, <gasps> it's still alive! Ooh. It's still alive and well. Is someone injured? I see gold in your future. <laughs> we should probably silence it. I'm gonna kill the totem. All right, we stand a chance. As long as he doesn't kill our board this turn, we are good. We are good to go. Just don't kill my board. You already used one volcano. And a lightning storm. What are the chances he has another volcano? That would be so unfortunate. If he runs two volcanoes. All right, Chieftain and a one mana card. Yeah, we can deal with this. We can deal with this. Purify. Not the strongest of cards. Alright, let me do some cow calculations. This always happens. Now this gets healed, right? We have no inner fire. So if we go visions, inner fire, this goes to 10. This is 14. Nah, it's not even it's not even close. We could go with defender trade and it lives at 1 at the maelstrom. I wonder. Probably. My shield for Argon. Eh. Like all he could, he was he's going to maelstrom here. 
or he's gonna like hero power spell pow, spell fucking totem into like lightning storm mail or maelstrom lightning storm that would be bad but then he needs to roll spell power and have both those cards in his hand and he didn't do that last turn so i think we're good and we know we can get an inner fire with shadow visions because we still have two inner fires in the deck and there's only 11 cards left so he has to clear board he has to kill everything or he loses because then we just go talon priest spirit inner fire wrecked Hey, Rube, do you have any tips on pushing through the ranks when you get to rank 5? Devolve? No, he runs two Devolves? Are you fucking quacking me, mate? We can still win as long as he doesn't kill our 5-4. God damn it! <laughs> Watch, this fucking Alarmo bot is gonna pull our Talon Priest. This is gonna fuck us so hard. This guy wrecked me. Double evolve into the Alarmo bot to take away our give plus three HP. This is so unfortunate. Talon Priest. Rip. Oh, not Talon Priest. And we even drew our inner fire. I don't think there's a way we can win, though. We don't have enough HP. Alright, so let me do... So that's three, so that'd be six. That's twelve. We need to get the other Divine Spirit from our deck. And we can win. So now, no, it can't attack. I forgot it can't attack. What about this one? So it go to 5, 10, 15, 16. Oh, we were 1 HP off. No way. That's so unfortunate to be 1 HP off. Because that's 5, 10. No, 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 no. We're good. We're good. I'm just, I think I'm quacking. I'm, I'm retarded. I was thinking 5, 10, and then 15 because, but I forgot it doubles it. It doesn't go by fives. I, again, I haven't played the deck a whole bunch. I was, I was, I was just, I was just pulling your guys' chain. I knew what I was doing the whole time. Sorry. <laughs> I I didn't realize the power of the mean priest. You know what I mean? There's a lot of power in this deck. I, I didn't I didn't see it like you guys did. This this that was that was raw power. I was really scared to touch it, as you could see. I was honestly pretty scared. There was a lot going on. All right, so now we know. All right, if this is pirates, then we get rid of both of those. We keep pain. You scared. You started to scare me a little bit there. Nah, it was all part of the plan. Meme priest is gonna lose to pirate warrior. Oh no. Oh no. I would. I, I'll take pirate warrior all day with meme priest. We play humongous razor leaf and give it taunt. <laughs> what are they gonna do? <laughs> what are you gonna do when a, humong a humongous razor leaf comes for you? There's nothing you really can do. And he even drew pooches. He even drew the pooches. Do we play the cleric? I have a feeling it's just going to get uh No, we probably don't play the cleric. We probably just heal ourselves, to be honest. Because if we play the cleric, we know next turn we're razor leafing, and we're not even going to do that anyway. And it just dies to a war axe. But I guess it soaks three damage regardless. But I kind of want the draw, so I'm just going to heal. There's no point to raise or leaf yet. I mean, no point to cleric yet because he's just gonna war axe. Coin three drop berserker. Please play berserker. Oh, yes, yes. Notice me, senpai. Ooh. Ah. Now we can actually play the cleric. Ooh. Ah. Upgrade. Charge minion. Rip cleric. <laughs> it was nice knowing you. Ouchies. Oh -ho! You guys thought Pirate Warrior was going to beat my meme priest. I've specifically teched against such cards. This is going to be lit. 
It's time to rip open this pirate warrior. I'm going to take back my 6,000 legend. We're at 7,000. We've got to go back to 6,000, boys. <laughs> we deserve better than this. All right. So we'd purify. And then we would taunt. But then we can't fit in a heal. But if we silence, taunt, we can fit in a heal. What is in I prefer that. Feels good, man. How long are you streaming for, Rube? Uh, probably till about seven. But tips for getting leg or going uh, higher ranks, um, I would just say, I don't know, stick to the decks you enjoy and you do well with. It's hard to say. The Kinsamida hits the floor. <laughs> the meme priest takes another victim. <laughs> Alright guys, we're going to end the episode there. I'm sure I will be playing some more Meme Priest in the future and also be doing the deck guide on it fairly soon. So with that said, thanks for watching. Of course, I'm Warshack and happy whatever the hell day it is.